Hi guys, it's Max from High on Android. Today we're gonna do a slightly different video. In the last few weeks, actually, I've been working on my DIY backyard putting green, along with a uh, um, you know practice net. Anyway, I'm not 100% done, it's, but it's you know pretty much done. But let's go ahead and take a quick look at the results. Solid. Try some. So the reason why I built this DIY backyard putting green is for my daughter. Um, she's starting to play some golf tournaments and I want her to be able to practice some short shots, um, especially the short game is really important in golf. So. so initially I wanted to cheap out and I wanted to build my own DIY putting green from completely scratch from parts from Home Depot. So you can actually do that. Um, you just need to get some gravel, compact it, put some sand, compact it, and basically put some artificial grass. And you will have to get the special kind for golf, not the regular stuff, because then you won't be able to actually putt on it. So that was my attempt. So I did try that. And I, I did make a small test version of it and it didn't roll pure because I used some cheap artificial grass and it's actually a lot of work. I wanted something that later I can go ahead and change it around. I didn't want to permanently install something in my backyard, something I can't remove. So I researched one of the best ones you can get is um, Dave Peltz. Uh, green maker. Dave Peltz has been innovating with putting stuff for the last 20 years with his drills and now he has a bunch of uh, putting green kits you can buy. The good thing with these is that you don't have to worry about where you put it. You, you put this indoors, outdoors. So I built this. It just comes with the roll of the synthetic grass and also it comes with a foam layer uh, underneath that you can build easily. It's like a puzzle. Um, it took me about an hour to put it together. And once I put it together, uh, the only problem I found was that because my backyard is not flat, because I live in a very hilly community um, near San Francisco, which is where I am, many houses like mine don't have flat ground. So that was a challenge for me. Um, so I moved some slabs around and right now I put it in a place where it's still a little bit hilly, but at least I've got some you know, pretty straight putts, all right? But Dave Pelt's putting system, I think is very good. It is a little bit more costly, but the good thing is that if you have like an extra room in your house, you could put it indoors or you could put it outdoors like myself. And I simply picked up some synthetic grass at Home Depot for the practice net. You could also do little chip shots to the putting green, which is great. So overall, I'm pretty satisfied. They also sell much bigger sizes. Obviously my backyard is not that big, so I got the smallest putting green. But if you have a big yard, I mean, you could totally just get the super huge one and you know they even got custom um, golf greens you can make I mean you can make a whole bunker putting green yada 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 anyway if you guys are interested in stuff like this which I'm sure you are if you're watching this I'll put some information in the description below that's pretty much it my daughter has a golf tournament um, next week so hopefully the new backyard putting green will help her have a great day and as always stay <laughs> on putting greens click here to subscribe Thank mm -hmm. you.